If you set up a screensaver, your Mac can show you pretty patterns and pictures on the screen, like the one that you can see now. But you can actually set a screensaver that'll actually teach you something. How to do that is to open up System Preferences and come to the Desktop and Screensaver. Here's the choices that you can make. Here's an interesting one though, RSS Visualizer. Select that one. And then by default, you'll actually see Apple Hot News, like this. And then if you press 1, as it suggests you do, the screensaver goes away, your Mac opens up Safari and takes you to the item that you wanted to see. I'm going to quit Safari. You're not stuck with Apple's hot news though. Come to the Options section and now you can choose any feed that you've already subscribed to in Safari. Or you might like to add another feed of your own choosing. In that case, come down here to the Feed Earl and remove the item that's in there and paste in the Earl, for example, for Mac Tips. Click Done and I'm going to hit the Test button to see what it looks like. Now what you see is the heading of the most recent tip, the first few words, and then again you can press a key, one or two, if it's the second tip, three or four, to actually go and read that particular item on the web. Pretty cool. Another thing that you can do is check out a word of the day. Click on word of the day, and again have a look at the options. There aren't many options here. You get to choose a dictionary. The choices are the New Oxford American Dictionary or a Japanese Dictionary or Automatic. Automatic, I imagine, picks up the language that your computer's set to. I'll choose that. Click Done. And again, click Test. In a moment or two, a couple of shadowed words will come up, but they'll clear away and then a particular word comes and stays on screen and it shows you the pronunciation and a couple of definitions. Press the D key and the dictionary opens up and shows you more information about that word. I'll quit dictionary. That's it for screensavers that can teach you something. Give it a whirl, see how it looks to you.